What's up guys? Welcome back to Outdoor Chef Life. I'm Taku. Day two on the yacht. If you guys didn't see the last episode, go check it out. We're gonna get a white sea bass today. Let's do this. So let me get you caught up. We stayed in this yacht last night. Be so beautiful, so nice. Um, this is freaking amazing. And we had some white sea bass for dinner last night and some yellowtail. Um, and so Lance and Kyle, uh, they both shot a white sea bass uh, yesterday and I didn't get one. I had a nice nice look at one, but I didn't take the shot. But today, I'm gonna take a shot today. We're gonna get one. Maybe. I hope. Let's try. We'll try our best to get one. Yeah, conditions looking okay. Looking okay. A little bit of wind, but not too bad. Water's looking pretty nice. They're chilling. Yeah, that's such a cool spot to chill. It's a nice, relaxing spot. This Lance is flying a drone right now. He's trying to spot the white sea bass in the kelp uh, with the drone. So the question is, will I get a white sea bass today? You think so? Yeah. I think there's a I think there's a chance. There's at least a chance. I saw yeah at least five yesterday. Back to back to back. But at that time, I had just gotten in the water, so I was not really not really ready for that. <laughs> and uh, yeah, just got way too. A little jittery, a little you know, adrenaline going. My heart started pumping. When I calmed down and I was like ready, we didn't see anymore. <laughs> and that was yesterday. So today, yeah, we'll see what happens. We might jump in there. We might see them right away again. So, but this time I think I'll be ready. Just need one. I just need one to swim like right under me, so I can just pop, pop them in the head from above. That's what I just uh, keep playing in my head, anyways. That's the, the ideal situation, I think. Just from the surface, just point down, pull the trigger, and stone him. Just just make him float up, you know? Just boom, perfect shot, and just so he doesn't, doesn't even fight at all. Just instant kill. That would be ideal. <laughs> but very unlikely that I get, I, I stone a, a white sea bass in my first shot. <laughs> I haven't even taken a shot. Oh. Go. And here we go. First thing we know, the water clarity isn't very good. Maybe the same as yesterday, or just slightly better. You can see there's a bit of current, which you can tell by looking at the kelp and how they're sideways. That means they're getting pulled down by the current. And that may not be the most ideal conditions, but it's not too bad. We're gonna make this work. So the plan here is to move slow through the water, as stealthy as possible. We don't wanna spook the fish. We wanna sneak up on them and get a nice shot off, nice and close. These white sea bass like to hang out in the kelps when they're full of food and when they're ready to spawn. And they move slow through the kelps, very slow, sometimes not even moving at all and they can be right on the surface. So all we have to do is find that school of fish and get close enough to take an accurate shot. Yesterday I was pretty close and I had a shot, but I just wasn't comfortable taking a shot yet because I had just gotten in the water. But today, I'm focused, I'm calm, and I'm ready to take my shot. Let's see if we can find one. A little update here. At this point, it's been a little over an hour and no fish yet. Look 
two fish, one there, one there. There's probably a lot right here. Nice taco! Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> yes! Nice! Oh man! That was crazy! <laughs> he was trying to drown me! 
<laughs> Where did you shoot him? Perfect, right here. Oh, nice. Boom. <laughs> It came out here, I guess. Oh, it went in there. Right, went in there. Yeah. Went in there. Came out Ooh. right behind the fin. Wow. Right there. That's a solid shot. Nice lucky shot. <laughs> Where were you aiming? At the fish. <laughs> he was trying to pull me down. I grabbed. Yes. <laughs> yes. Woo! <gasps> Good job. Thank you. <gasps> Yeah, I shot him, and then yeah, he just headed straight down. He kind of held on to to the the actual like line. yeah the shooting line. Yeah, and I kind of just held him, and then he actually felt like he got stronger um, a little bit later, maybe 10, 10 seconds later, and he started like pulling me down, and then I was like, oh shoot, I gotta go get back up, breathe. Yeah, I couldn't really hold my breath at that point, too much adrenaline. <laughs> yeah, he's about 25, huh? Yeah. Awesome. Oh my gosh, that's so amazing. Thank you, Lance. Yeah, great job. You did exactly, you did everything right. Well, we're in there for almost an hour? Well over an hour. Well over an hour? Yeah, we didn't see anything. I know, Until, missed you shooting it for five minutes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we didn't see anything. And then we saw this little school, and then Lance pulls it out. And we yeah, go down to the kelp right there. And I kind of just slowly dove down slightly, and this guy kind of turned perfectly, too. Kind of, yeah. And then, so I had a nice shot, and I was like, I gotta take this one. Perfect shot. Yeah, yeah. Really good position there. It was probably a school of about five or ten. We could only see maybe three or four of them. Yeah. But yeah, it was perfect. You did everything right. Thank you. <laughs> Great job. Oh my gosh. Thank you. Thank you. Oh my gosh. It's a beautiful fish. Beautiful. Yeah. Fish. Beautiful. Yeah. Beautiful turquoise. Got a bluish green on top, and there's definitely purple in there too. It's so cool! Oh my gosh! Remind me of the wetsuit pants. What's that? Your wetsuit pants that you wear on the kayak? Oh yeah! Well, I can't believe it. Yes! The hole in. All right. I think about 26, 27. Nice. Oh, okay. Yeah. That is a great <laughs> first fish. Look at yeah. that. First white sea bass ever. Take the guts out. Take the gills off. I don't want to puncture it just in case it's a female. Let's look. Oh, that's a female. Yay. Nice. What you going to make with the eggs? I don't know. No, look at that. This thing is fat. The rose, huge. Oh, big eggs. Yeah. Nice. Nice. Beautiful. The liver, the liver's big too. Just taking the gills off here. You want to take off anything that 
contains blood basically. Blood makes the meat go bad. Call my friend Dwight after this when we get back to shore. See if he's available to print my fish. He's usually pretty busy, so we'll see. Air bladder or something? Oh. Right? Yeah, pretty large air bladder. Yeah, it's huge. Yeah. I shot right through it. And if you're wondering why we didn't just fish for white sea bass, you see it while we were diving that it's so the kelp is so thick right here where, where the white sea bass are. And if you fish for them here, even if you hook up, they're just gonna run you right into the kelp, wrap around, probably break off. Um, so spear fishing is is the best way um, in this kind of conditions, right? And in this time of year, this, this time where, of year the the fish are spawning in the kelp. Yeah. So. Um, they're, you know, pretty pretty easy to get in the kelp if you can get into the kelp. Yeah. Any big ones? No, I saw a lot. Yeah. But all about the same size. I kept looking for something bigger. Yeah. Yeah. It's hard as a spur fisherman not to shoot them. Yeah. yeah. Because you know everything in your body says there's a fish. It's legal. Let's yeah. Let's take it. But I was just looking for a bigger fish, and you know it's it's hard. It's hard, but it feels good to be responsible and. Just take what you need. And yeah, just take so what I you let need. a lot of fish swim right by me, point blank. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Well, <laughs> that's nice too. Yeah. We got here, so we're actually back in the harbor now, uh, and we actually stayed one more night in the harbor, uh, just so we don't have to. We didn't have to drive uh, the night back to the bay, and yeah, how, what an amazing experience this was. Being on the yacht, sleeping on the yacht, shooting a white sea bass, all of that. Oh my God, can you believe that? <laughs> Still can't believe I shot that white sea bass. Uh, incredible, but amazing, uh, amazing time. And special shout out, of course, to Lance. Uh, Caroline and Kyle, amazing time and amazing hosts, um, really kind people, uh, amazing. I can't believe that starting a YouTube channel would lead to something like this, you know, opportunities like this, uh, amazing. So thank you guys so much, uh, we really had a good time, amazing time. So when I got back to the harbor, I messaged my friend Dwight, you might have seen him in another video of mine, and he does the printing, so, and he lives, uh, maybe an hour or two hours away actually so we're gonna actually go to his place and we're gonna print my YC bass all right so now we're at Dwight's home we're in his studio here look at all the beautiful artwork behind him uh, and he's gonna print the YC bass so we'll watch him do that if you guys haven't seen Dwight if you don't remember him from the last video that he was in amazing amazing artist I, he printed this one right here <laughs> yeah so he's gonna print this YC bass as well Make sure to check him out on Instagram. He's got a lot of cool stuff he's doing. He just printed a deep sea creature. What was that fish? An anglerfish. 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 That thing was crazy, man. Yeah. That thing looks crazy. Yeah, he just uh, printed that the other day. Um, so he's doing all kinds of cool stuff like that. So make sure to check him out. Oh, 
Ooh. <laughs> oh my goodness. Look at that. Wow. What we were doing last time, the pan thing, I was like, it was all awkward. I didn't oh, yeah. understand what you were doing. I still yeah. don't. <laughs> we were just trying. Yeah, that was funny. <laughs> Is it recording already? Yeah. Okay. My wife, Sea Bass, turned into a beautiful artwork. What an amazing experience that was on the boat. Just getting in the water and seeing these guys. Amazing time, amazing experience. And what a great way to finish it off by having it printed by my good friend Dwight here. As he's, always, he's always killing it with these. Amazing, amazing. Thank you so You're much welcome. again. Yeah. yeah, thanks for bringing it over. What a joy. Oh was, man. Yeah, my first white printing, my white sea bass, first one. Yeah, <laughs> nice, <laughs> nice. That's perfect. Ooh. Yeah, I keep saying it, but I still can't believe it. Still can't believe we got it. All right, guys, we're home now. Uh, a lot of driving, so we haven't had any time to fillet the fish or anything. Uh, but we'll do that on the next episode, so this video isn't too long. But make sure to check out Dwight, amazing artist, amazing guy. Um, thank you guys for watching. And again, thank you for the half a million subscribers. Amazing, guys. Amazing. All right, see you guys on the next one. Yeah, we, I got some good ideas. <laughs> my god <laughs> i have some really really good ideas for this white sea bass we have a lot of fish and a lot so we can experiment with a lot of it so we're going to make some cool recipes we're going to make yeah so we'll, we'll do all of that on the next one so see you guys next time peace